Petros, like a bad South African penny, I showed back up. <laughs> Ain't seen you in, oh, forget all that, how many years would I have it? <laughs> you know, I tell people all the time, you know, I'm a trained stage manager. You know, and what the stage manager does in theater, but people don't understand, he's the only one that doesn't have a vested interest in you know, a personal interest in the piece, what he wants to do or she wants to do. I don't want to be politically correct. Look, what, what the stage manager wants to do is take the ingredients they have with the budget they have and make it work, right? For me, you're, you're at the Center for Film and Media Study. You are the ultimate administrator, whatever, glue that, that blah, 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 blah. In fact, what, I'm a, you know, I keep on talking, you know I do, but I have to say this. When I first came, when Ian Glenn hired me, right, mm -hmm. they, you know, they send the email, blah, blah, and they said, if you, they kept on saying, if you have any questions, ask Petros, ask Petros. And I'm going like, what's a Petros? Because I never heard the name. I said, what's a Petros, you know? So I came and I found out what a Petros says. You are the one, the only, the man, the myth, the legend. Tell us people who you are. Well, I am Petros Ndlela. <laughs> Administrator of Film and Media Studies. Um, I've been here for years. Yes, people. For wait, wait, put a number on that. For 19 years. 19. 19 years. Okay, okay. Um, and um, yeah, people who are not South Africans actually always ask, what is Petros? Everybody keeps in. <laughs> Go to Petros, turn around the corner. Then we'll see, we'll see who Petros is. But yeah, I've been in the department for years. Um, um, and I know, in fact, people think I even know the texture of the cement used to make this building. <laughs> they would be correct. They would be correct. You may deny it, but they would be correct. <laughs> but you've been through a lot here. I mean, there's a lot since I left, or even when I was here, there's a lot going. The, the, the fees must fall, road mm -hmm. statue, all the rest of that's Absolutely. You know, <laughs> yeah, now, well, how did that affect the department? How did that affect you? It, it, it affected a whole lot of us. Mm -hmm. um, in fact, everybody who was here, we have to change certain things, we had to adapt in certain things. Um, and we were part of uh, of those changes. Mm -hmm. Students, staff, and in fact, everybody. Um, and there was fire, it also affected all of us, buildings, toilets, mm -hmm. um, teaching venues, mm -hmm. um, and the lot. And some people passed on um, as well uh, mm. along that along along, uh, along those um, um, difficult times mm. COVID came COVID is still here but we're back here again mm -hmm. we're still doing our stuff mm. well here's okay let me, I have to say this I, I live in the Eastern Cape now right uh, yes. uh, but here you come from the Eastern Cape now the, the, before we go let me say this it seems to me, and this is true, everybody knows this, Eastern Cape has all the talent. But with the, it's, whatever it is, academics, of, 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 of course, entertainment, all that stuff, right? Yes. And um, you, you'll go to Joburg or Cape Town and you just set it on fire, you know? Oh, tell me about that. I mean, where, where, where were you born in Eastern Cape? How did you, you get to, to, to Cape Town? Um, we moved to Cape Town in the 80s, I think 1980, 81. But I come from an area called Ekomani, Queenstown. Oh, Queenstown. Oh, you're up there with the cold, the, the, the cold people, you're in the mountains. Yes, or whatever. we do. I grew up in those mountains. Um, and um, I've been in Cape Town. I still have family in, 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 in Ekoman. Um, my sisters are there, my cousins are there. Friends, I think I went to finish my high school there as well. Um, but we only go, as you mm -hmm. earlier said, when there is a funeral. <laughs> Eastern Cape funerals, my goodness, you know. <laughs> but I didn't go to my cousin's funeral recently because I felt like, why must I go when there is a funeral? I must just go. <laughs> okay, stop. So I, I, I'm sorry. Let, let me, I don't want to stop you from talking, but let's stop talking about that. But there's something that happened here that's kind of interesting, because when I left, you were taking courses. Now, because, you know, if you're at a university, if you are uh, a staff, then you may give you a break on the fees and you blah, blah, blah. But you're so essential. 
Tell us what happened. You was trying to take your... This was a while ago. Well, tell me what it happened. It was a while ago where I had to deregister from a call service. You had to deregister? I de-register. You yourself had to deregister? I had to deregister because the university was not happy that I was not at my desk at a certain time, on a certain date. <laughs> <laughs> and they... Argument was that they pay for my time, although I pay back my time by starting an hour late. If I know, for instance, today at four, I will be attending a class so that I can be able to go to the class. But the university felt, <laughs> in fact, they kept reminding me that my primary job is here in the office, oh. not in the lectures. And oh. I thought they are not happy and I can start from that course. But you know what that is. You know exactly what that is. You that's what I'm trying to say. You are so essential to this to the film and media studies department. I'm serious. I'm this is I'm okay, I'm not joking right now. Just, you are so essential. Let me put it this way. You know a lot of other ministers. Are there is that the normal thing that an administrator is so essential that the department can't run without that? It just not in other departments. I know a colleague of mine down the corridor who graduated with a master's last year and he has registered for PhDs, doing mm-hmm. exactly the same thing I'm doing, except that you get support in order to do that. Um, if you do not get support, then you are in trouble because you, they will keep reminding you of your primary job. Although you didn't do that behind their backs, you actually sit down and say, this is my program, this is what I want to do. If the department or the university is happy, then this is the way I want to go. But I felt they were not happy. If they were happy, they would not remind me every almost every week to say your primary job is in that office. <laughs> but you know, you, you have another, like I said, stage managers, say in theater or whatever, uh, people come and basically, they, they cry on the stage manager, oh, the director is, oh, they, they, they cry on your shoulder. And in a way, weird way, you are the psychologist for people come, I'm serious, people come to your office I mean, I'm talking about staff and students and who I don't know, whoever else you got. Why is that? Why, why do you think that is? It's just your personality. What, what, what is that? It's, it's it, it, I think it's all about, for me, it's about the, 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 the accomplishment of what you're supposed to be doing or not even what you're supposed to be doing. It's about people get things done hmm. when I have given them how to do them um, or if they can't for instance somebody would come to my office and say, oh the tv doesn't work in venue x y and z <laughs> only, <laughs> only to find out no man it's all you need to do is to just switch it on <laughs> at the plug <laughs> that's what i said oh my goodness <laughs> it's worse than being a parent it's worse than being a <sighs> yeah, i know i know but um yeah all the other stuff is being done. Um, they know that I'll get things done. Um, even some of my colleagues just, if they want something done, they just say, Petros, do your magic. <laughs> and I know what that means. <laughs> I'm not doing magic. It's just that it has to be, I'll, I'll make sure that it is done. Wow, wow, um, wow. I guess that's why students actually even come to confirm to me, a lecturer, you as a lecturer can tell a student, <laughs> But Petra said this. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Instead of being the other okay. way around. No, that <laughs> sums it up. No, that actually sums it up. Let's get off that. Leave that alone. I have some, you know, you know we've had many conversations. Uh, it, it, I don't want to say that you was my therapist as much as if I wanted to understand something, really, because, you know, when I do so, yes. I try to understand it at another level. But everybody's doing a regular level. I'm trying to understand it at another level. So I would come to you for history just for understanding a situation, right? Yes. Now, tell me about that. Well, not, not necessarily, but me. Do you get that a lot? I get that a lot from my colleagues, from other departments as well, from mm-hmm. my colleagues here in the department. Um, I don't know. I mean, I... If I go now, we go to the next building. Mm. If I introduce myself to anybody, they'll say, oh, 
Petros, <laughs> that Petros, they know something about <laughs> about mm. me. I don't know if that, I don't think it's about being here forever. It's also about being um, helpful to other people, uh -huh. being mm. um, sorted out if mm. there is a problem that needs to be sorted out. I'll go all out if, for instance, you needed a venue mm. with viewing equipment mm. and you teaching audio. You, must have a venue for that and that, mm -hmm. that will be sorted out I'll, I'll mm -hmm. make sure that it, it, it is sorted or um, if even the coffee machine is not mm -hmm. working i'll make sure that it works mm -hmm. um that kind of thing i think it's all about um people getting um things sorted um mm -hmm. uh, some of them feel comfortable um knowing that this will go right if there is a touch of petros mm -hmm. Well, you know, when I was teaching here, because, you know, my, my class, I would, I they, they would be all over the place. And then one time I, I was at the library, I said, this is a good little space here. So instead of having the venue in, uh, you know, turning the TV on in the class, I said, let's go to the library. And so I think I asked you, I said, well, how blah, blah. And you just told me what to do, who to talk to, how to get that done. Those are the kind of things, you know. Now, I, I don't want to talk. To, look, I, I could talk to you forever. But I just want to ask you sort of a weird personal question. Now, in the Eastern, like there's a lot of talented people, but yes. a lot of, but you, but they're talented on every level. Now, uh, when I first came to Cape Town, it was interesting because I was amazed. It was people loved opera. I mean, not to give you know, but I mean, I don't say black people, but you yes, know, the, the, yes. the, the autochthonous Africans love opera. And you were singing opera. Tell me, just tell me about that. Figure all this academic stuff. What, are you still doing opera? What, what's happening with it? Um, not anymore. All I do is to just go to opera productions because I know I've been involved in, 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 in choral music for a while. Um, now, because of COVID restrictions, oh. there were no live um, broadcast, live performances and stuff. It's only starting to 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 to. to, to to, to pick up now, mm -hmm. and I know quite a lot of people mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, 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 in opera. My office as well always plays opera, <laughs> and students would think, That's who cool. is this man playing opera, and he's black? <laughs> 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 but uh, I, 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 I still love opera. Mm -hmm. I, still, um, I, I still even get tickets from graduates from UCT. <laughs> Um, to, to, to attend to, 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 to go to opera, but that is still alive. I'm still mm. playing it, I'm still attending um, with those few productions, especially when these kids who graduated in, mm. at UCT come back to perform. I always make sure mm. I even went to stand as far as Stellenbosch mm. to attend. As far as Stellenbosch, <laughs> yeah, typ typical, you know, Cape Town. <laughs> I went as far as Stellenbosch, I went, you know. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna stop with that. Okay, leave, leave me alone because you know, I'll leave you alone. Okay, I, I want to, this one more, um, a tiny thing, and I guess along the same lines, I've I, I always think about you. I'm yeah. I always think about you. I mean, you know, yeah. and I'm, I'm I'm serious, but I'm, I'm do do a lot of all these years to like I said, 19 years. People do. People keep on coming back to you. Say, they they give you, do. give you reports of what they've been doing and all that stuff. They, they, they do. It's not even fun. I would go to um, a party somewhere, mm -hmm. and somebody would remind. Oh, I know you. Um, I studied at the at your department at some stage. Mm -hmm. You did this when I was a <laughs> an undergraduate student, mm -hmm. or somebody at my local mm -hmm. shopping center would say, and you buy. Any chance Petros who went in film and media? <laughs> I normally say to people, I'm not film and media, I'm Petros. <laughs> <laughs> that's good. No, no, that's excellent. Because people would tend to, to, that's interesting. No, 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 this is very good. Because people tend to label people. You're, you're a socialist, you're whatever. But you, if you say, no, I'm a Petros, then they got to figure out what that is, which means that you're all those things, actually, that they think and more. You know? Yes. Yes. Okay, and you are more Petros. Thank you so very much for for taking this little bit. Of time. No, forget that. Thank you, thank you for being on the planet the same time a bunch of us are on the planet. That's thank what I'm you. Thank All you right. so much, Anthony. All right, man. I Take care. It. You All too, right. man.